Now, thousands of schools across Wales and England could be hit by strike action this summer. That's the warning from the largest teaching union, the NUT, which will vote on escalating its conflict with the government at its annual conference tomorrow. The teaching unions are incensed at plans to change their pensions and they've accused the Education Secretary, Michael Gove, of bullying tactics. Our social affairs editor, Jackie Long, reports. They're coming out of the classroom and going on to the attack. This is teachers in London on strike last week, but there could be similar scenes across the country if the NUT votes tomorrow to escalate industrial action. Strike action is still very much on the card. Teachers are very, very angry about the way in which they're being treated by government, just like other public sector workers, forced to pay more for their pensions, work longer and get less at the end of it. I think the mood of the conference will be one of unity in continuing our campaign to ensure that fairness prevails for teachers and all public sector workers. Teachers say they feel under assault from a whole barrage of initiatives which one union describes as a bully's charter. They include a new Ofsted regime which will see much more monitoring of teachers at work. New rules which will allow heads to sack underperforming teachers within a term. Their pay's been frozen for two years and there'll be cuts to their pensions, which teachers say simply mean they'll contribute more, work longer and get less in return. We believe the government's policies are counterproductive. They're nothing to do with tackling the deficit. They're nothing to do uh, with the economic crisis. They're actually about their irrational contempt for public services and for public service workers, including teachers. But while teachers from both major unions were fighting their corner at separate conferences, no one from the government was available to speak. The Department of Education did issue this statement, though, saying... The deal on teachers' pensions is as good as it gets and takes the right balance. We've been in serious talks for months with unions to address their concerns and reach a final settlement. I will give you but while both major unions show no sign of backing down, the government too is clearly determined to push ahead with massive and widespread reform of education. Further collisions can only be inevitable.